This is about uh, restoring Commodore Amigas. This is a, a guy in Sweden who's called Mr. A, has spent 10 years working on this design for a PCB for an Amiga A500. And uh, basically it allows you to take a, if you've got an old, not working, corroded Amiga, that, that they seem to fetch between 100 and 150 pounds each on eBay at the moment. And this is a, a $90, a 90, something like that, something like $90, 90 pounds. Love letter from Sweden. The video is really irritating, the first part of it, but it's worth watching. It, 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 I learned a bit about Sweden from it. Buffering. Oh well, while well, that's loading up, look at that. So yeah. $95 will get you the board and the firmware and it's got a couple it puts a couple of microcontrollers on it to to optimize IO and allow you to use different more, more modern right. peripherals I think so uh, I've uh, set here he is. some things up here and I'm so not used to having a microphone in my face it's super annoying <laughs> I forget about it all the time, so apologies in advance if uh, if the sound is murky. I don't know if that's a word. Is murky a word? Mm. Anyways, uh, here we have uh, Denise, and I'm gonna try to move over to this. Look at this camera here, so you can have a look at her. This is a this is a four K purple ca camera uh, board. The ones that we distributed recently are black, as the one I showed you before. Um, yeah. And this is the audio. It's got a very, very carefully designed, high quality audio. And RGB video circuit. And basically, you can put it all into the box. Yeah, there you have it. Uh, the cable that's in between the two Soro slots is actually uh, a debug, debug serial. So I've attached an ESP8266 to it to be able to easily and remotely check the logs from it. So you, you can, if you've got an a old broken Amiga, you can take the chips out and build that circuit it's mostly through hole components you don't need you don't need to be you don't need to have microscopes for eyes in order to surface mount have all these surface mount stuff it's uh, really well designed that's a really good way of restoring old hardware There it is on Tindy. And now I'm going to go and see if I can get into the Houses of Parliament and listen to Andrew Bridgen about excess deaths. <laughs>